Hey guys, coming at you with another video here from Fairway Ford and Subaru of Greenville, South Carolina. Today we're checking out this 2021 Subaru BRZ. The reason the 21 is different from any of the others is because now it has the 2 liter boxer, which now has 205 horsepower, which really ups the power. You did have about 160 before. This one is the loaded up one, has all the features. Today I'm gonna be doing a little bit more of an in-depth review for you guys so you guys can see all of its quirks and features, everything that's going on with it. I'm going to be showing you the sticker price here. You can pause and check out all the features, but as you can see we have, this is actually a 2020 BRZ Limited. I thought this was a 2021, that's my bad. And we've got $31,806 as the total price. Working from back to front like we normally do, this does have a proximity key. As you know, Subaru keys, this is the unlock button, the Subaru logo. But we're going to open the back, so it is proximity, so if you push the button it'll open or you can push the button on the key fob. Uh, you got a usable amount of space with some tie downs back here. And if we open up under the floor actually, you can see we've got a donut tire. So this does have an actual spare tire, not a repair kit, which is pretty nice. Bat seats do exist, although they're not all that usable. This does have the Mustang style windows, so when you open the door, the window slides down slightly and slides back up when you close it. Looking at our door, you can see it's a real long, short door. Got some storage for a water bottle here. Elbow padding all along here, which is leather. And it's leather because we're in the Limited. So This one is the six-speed manual. As you can see, we got three pedals down below. Oh. Stepping inside. Got our trunk button here with our lights. Gauge cluster here, tack in the middle. Little uh, LCD on the side. Here's our steering wheel. Infotainment. I'm going to start this up for you. So, foot on the clutch. Push the start button. It starts right up. As you can see, we got dual zone climate. I agree. Have our infotainment in the middle. Has Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Sorry, I'm trying to get rid of this glare for you guys. There we go. And this is where our USB is for Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. We've got two of them. We also can adjust our track control, as well as engage track, track mode. Um, looking up the dash, we have leather pad up here. Down below, we got our glove box. You can see the amount of room that's in there. This does have heated seats. Two buttons right in the middle. See our passenger door over there, and here's a shot of our rear seats. Now you can't, you do have to slide this passenger seat forward to use it. Um, the driver's seat also has to slide forward. In the middle, we have two cup holders and a 12 volt in the front. Right here, and manual parking brake right there. Looking up top, we do have home link right here for your garage doors have our lights here. There's only one light. This comes down. See, we've got a mirror with a light. This slides back. It actually doesn't slide back, so that's that's what you get. But, I will say, these windows don't let in a whole lot of light anyway, so. We do have cruise control, as you can see right here, on this little knob. Now I'm going to take you outside, show you the engine. So we're going to pull this knob here. Subaru badge here. Reach underneath, push to the left. The hood's very light. I'm gonna pick up the prop rod.
see we got our oil filter on the top, like all boxer engines, or at least all the Subaru boxer engines. I'll give you a shot at these wheels and brakes. I'm actually going to close this hood real quick. Walk around. Share these wheels and brakes real quick. We do have wheel locks on this one. Here's our rear brakes. Show you our tail lights, our wing. You can see our exhaust right here. It is real exhaust. Reverse lights and brake light. And I'm going to give it a rev for you guys before we go so you guys can hear this beautiful engine. It's a, it sounds very good. Very good. Wouldn't say V8 Mustang good, um, but definitely great for a JDM. I'm going to spend the next 40 seconds to a minute or so just walking you guys around silently so you guys can really take it all in. Should mention this one does have Brembo brakes. All right, I appreciate you guys walking around this vehicle with me. If you guys enjoy the content, subscribe, like the video, comment on what you'd like to see next. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a great one.